you should stop. You should have stopped. A heartbroken mother sharing her grief after her 25 year old son was struck and killed by a hit and run driver in National City last week. ABC 10 News reporter Michael Chen has her emotional appeal for information. This was Julius Bautista in September playing music at the home he shared with his parents in Paradise Hills. Weeks later, Bautista, who has struggled with bipolar disorder for six years, left home. When he gets episode, he would not come home for like a week or two, but now it's the longest. His mother, Teresa, says he called her last Monday from a hospital and was receiving medication. He would always say, hello, mama. I'm getting better. Hours later, past 7 p.m., police say Bautista was walking along Paradise Valley Road east of Plaza Boulevard when he was struck by an SUV before he was struck by several other vehicles. Those drivers would stay at the scene while the SUV driver took off. Bautista would die at the scene. <laughs> A devastated Teresa says Bautista was big brother to her four other children. So he's a joy in my life. He is, he, he, he never hurt anybody. He is kind, he is cheerful. Teresa isn't sure where her son was headed that night, but he was about a half mile from home when he was struck by a hit and run driver. Very irresponsible. It, it's very irresponsible because this is a person we're talking about. You should stop, you should have stopped. <laughs> Teresa now making an appeal for tips. If you could please, just come forward and have the girl be brave enough to let us know what really happened. I, I just want some peace. Michael Chen, ABC 10 News. National City Police say the suspect vehicle is a 2012 to 2015 silver or gray Subaru or Mitsubishi SUV. Anyone with information is asked to call Crime Stopper.